Do you know just how dangerous sitting for long periods can be? You might not believe it, but this isn't just about being lazy. Sitting for long periods has already been identified by the World Health Organization as the fourth most preventable cause of death worldwide. About 70% of chronic diseases are linked to prolonged sitting. And the scariest part? Every year, millions of people around the world die simply because they sit too long. So the big question is, what exactly does sitting for long periods do to our bodies, and how does it harm us? First, sitting is part of our daily lives. Whether it's working, studying, eating, or scrolling on your phone, we often do it while sitting. But have you ever noticed that sometimes, even when doing nothing, sitting for too long makes you feel tired? Why does sitting make us exhausted? The truth is, our bodies are designed for movement. Our bones, muscles, and blood vessels only function properly when we stay active. Think of it like a machine. If a machine sits idle for too long, it rusts and breaks down. But when it runs, it lasts longer and works better. Studies show that people who sit for more than six hours a day are 26.7% more likely to develop chronic diseases compared to those who sit less than two hours. And for those who sit more than 10 hours a day, the risk of death rises by 34%. These numbers aren't just warnings. Once you sit for long periods, the muscles in your lower body basically go on strike. Around 70% of the body's muscles are in the lower half, and muscle movement not only moves bones but also helps blood flow through the veins. If you stay still for too long, your leg muscles stop working, slowing blood circulation. This doesn't just affect your legs, blood flow throughout your body is impacted, and over time, the risk of dangerous blood clots rises significantly. Those who have experienced blood clots know they're like a ticking time bomb. If a clot breaks free from a blood vessel, it can become immediately life-threatening. On top of that, prolonged sitting heavily affects your brain. Office workers who sit for long periods often struggle with focus and memory issues because prolonged sitting reduces the blood flow reaching the brain. It doesn't stop there. Sitting for extended periods also slows down your digestive system. Waste in the intestine stays there longer, water is absorbed excessively, and stools become hard. That's why people who sit for long periods often struggle with constipation. All in all, prolonged sitting impacts nearly every part of the body. So, if you've been sitting for more than an hour straight, it's crucial to get up and move around a bit. The ideal approach is to alternate between sitting and standing, keeping your body active and healthy.